hello everybody welcome back again to my channel today i'm going to be showing you guys how to make akamu akamu is one of the nigerian staple so this is the corn that i'm going to be using and i'm going to soak it for a day And this is after 24 hours, I'm going to siever the water and clean it properly. You can see how the water is looking. Then I'm going to transfer it into my blender. Already is looking soft and I will go ahead and start blending the corn. Make sure it is well blended. And here is the corn and I'm going to pour it in a bowl while I start washing out the akamu or the pap or custard in it. So I'm going to be using a mesh bag because I want to extract the pap from the shaft. So you watch and see how I'm going to be doing it. I add in water. That water is what I'm going to use to rinse out as I'm washing it. The pap is draining inside the bowl. I'm going to be doing this till I completely wash out the pap and it will be left with a corn shaft or the meal this is what I'm going to be doing till I get every pop out of the shaft so this is the second batch you are going to improvise try to um use the necessary equipment that you have this is the third batch that i'm washing out this is so amazing i can't believe i did this and this is the shaft that came out from the pub i fed the dock that comes behind my house with that now you can see the bottom of the bowl that is the pap or the custard or the akamu I will allow it to settle over the night and this is it i'm going to be draining out the water that is the pap i am going to pour it in a mesh bag and allow the extra water in it to drain out gradually i'm not going to press it i will leave it overnight why the water keep draining out because if i press it most of the pap is going to like i said most of the pap is going to come out so this is the end product this is a camo it is ready like you can see you can call it a camo or pap or custard actually when you dry this part of it that turns into custard right but i'm going to leave it wet like this and i'm going to be saving it in the fridge you can put it in a jar and toss it in the freezer or you leave it like this so what goes with akamu you combine akamu with akara so what did i do I made akara for this akamo and this is 
what we mostly eat in Nigeria as breakfast. Saturday mornings, on the weekdays, on a Sunday. So I want to say thank you to all of you that comes to watch my video. If you have not subscribed, kindly do it. And I will see you in my next. Bye.